Live from Southwest Florida, you're watching Fox 4 News at 6. Another half hour of local news and reports starting right now here on Fox 4. I'm Chris Searle. Thanks for joining us here on this Tuesday night. We start off in Lee County at South Fort Myers High School where a lockdown came out today as investigators arrested a student. Fox 4 heard about the lockdown earlier on this Tuesday, reaching out to Lee County schools to find out what was happening. A spokesperson told us a lockdown was issued because of a disruptive student who was carrying a gun. Fox 4's Calvin Lewis has been on the campus for hours learning more information. He joins us live with the very latest. Calvin. Well, Chris, that spokesperson tells us the lockdown took place earlier today in the morning, in fact, and as we stand out here tonight, you can see the school has reopened and even we're told after school activities have resumed here tonight. Now, in a letter to the school, Principal Ed Matthews says the Lee County Sheriff's Office received a tip of suspicious activity at the school earlier today. While deputies were investigating, the student involved, we're told, tried to run from school resource officers at about 1030 this morning, resulting in a short lockdown to keep the campus safe. Now, the school district says all students are safe and the sheriff's office is handling the investigation here on out. Now, classes resumed after that lockdown, including after school. We did speak with us what that experience was like inside the school during that lockdown. And everyone was just kind of worrying like because it just it happens so often so it's just like it's always that worry like and it, this wasn't the first time we've been on lockdown before. I know a couple of months prior we were also on lockdown because of a similar situation. The district has said this kind of behavior will not be tolerated and in addition to legal consequences, the student involved will be disciplined to the fullest extent of the student code of conduct, conduct, which we did look up, meaning they will be expelled. And we are still working to learn more details about this incident, but for now, the school is safe. For now, reporting live here in Fort Myers, Calvin Lewis, Fox 4.